Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do a get to know me tag. Um, I haven't done one of these before and I'm pretty excited about it. I just found some questions online, so I'm going to go through those. And um, yeah, that way you guys can get to know me a little bit more. We can kind of keep this relationship a little bit more intimate, which is what I want. Um, essentially, I do want to, um, I guess, get close to my audience. So if you guys would like to get to know me, then just keep watching because this is going to happen. <laughs> um, if I keep looking this way, I'm sorry, it's because the questions are right here and I'm not, I'm not equipped to memorize all of these questions, so I'm going to do that for you guys. Um, the first question is, what is your middle name? And my middle name is Monique. So my full name is Brianna Monique Herrera, and um, so that's my middle name. Uh, my favorite color, I really don't have like a specific favorite color. I always say that my favorite color is the rainbow because I do really enjoy all colors. Uh, let's just go with the rainbow is my favorite color. Um, who was your first best friend? Um, her name was Tessa, and I always thought that we were, like, super close, like, oh, my God, this girl's my best friend. Like, I, you know, I don't know. In my head, we were really good friends. And um, there was one day she was sitting behind me. I think it was, like, story time or something at school. I don't know. But we were all sitting down, and I remember she she's like, I want to play with your hair. So, of course, I, you know, we're little, and playing with her is fun. So she sat behind me, and um, I don't know if she was playing with my hair, blah, 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 whatever. The day ended, and my mom picked me up, and she saw that I had fucking boogers on my back. Like, this girl, Tessa, had been putting boogers on my back this whole time. Like, how did that even... I don't even know what that was. Um, but I had to, like... Like, she tore my shirt off of me, and she's like, this is fucking good. Like, it really was just a huge thing. And, um, till this day, like, that's just the funniest story. I can't believe that she would do that. But, you know, we were little, and whatever. I don't know, but I honestly thought that this girl was, like, my good friend. And, turns out, she was putting boogers on my back. <laughs> um, okay, so next question is, how tall are you? And I am 5'2". Five, three, one of those, I'm not sure. Uh, cats or dogs? I definitely prefer dogs, but honestly, I'm not really like an animal person. I do love like other people's animals. I'm very kind to animals. I don't like animal abuse, anything like that. Um, but I just, yeah, I don't know. I, I have, I have had animals before, but I think that's one of the reasons why, like, I steer away from animals is because I know the responsibilities that come with animals, and I'm just like, I'm just not about that life right now. <laughs> what is your favorite drink? Um, at the moment, I would definitely have to say coffee, and uh, DD is like my biatch right now. Like that coffee, ooh, it kind of spits. DD coffee, like, that is the coffee that, like, sets me off. Like, I, so I don't know what they put in their coffee, but it seems like a little Prozac, if you ask me. <laughs> um, so that's my favorite drink. Um, my favorite animal would have to be horses. I just love how big and beautiful they are, yet they're, like, such sweet creatures. I don't know. Um, horses are definitely my favorite. My favorite perfume is, um, it's called Escada Rock in Rio. Fruity, but sophisticated. So I like that one a lot. Um, let's see. Tea or coffee? Honestly, both. I love tea. I love a good sweet tea. I love a good green tea. I don't like it too sweet. I like my tea to be, I like just a hint of, um, sweetness in my tea, but I do love both. Um, what would you or have you named your children? So I named my daughter Luna, and uh, her name is Luna Monique. And, of course, that's because my middle name is Monique, and I just wanted to kind of carry on that. Um, or make a new tradition, actually, because my mom's middle name isn't Monique. Actually, it is. Oh, my God. My mom's middle name is Monique, but it's spelled. Um, so that's the backstory. Her middle name is Monique, too, or also, or whatever. And... Um, 
hers is spelled M-O-N-I-C-E, and so they called her, they call her Monica. Her real name is Rochelle, but our whole family has always called her Monica, and it's because of her middle name beginning, because it's spelled M-O-N-I-C-E, so it's Monique, but um, I guess technically it would be Monice, so whatever, I don't know, that's a little backstory. Um, what sports do you play or have you played? I used to play softball um, when I was younger, maybe like 11 or 12, and I was horrible. I was really bad. I couldn't catch a ball. Um, I was one of those kids that was like in the outfield or out, you know, really far from the, uh, I don't even remember what that shit is called. Um, I don't know, whatever, far from the like batting area, like catch the ball, look at the ball, you know, and I was just horrible. I am not a, I'm not a sports type of girl. Um, let's see. Um, who are some of your favorite YouTubers? Um, I really like Allison Bird. She's really cute and stylish, and she's a mom, and I just like that we have those kind of things in common. Um, I really like, who else? I like Bunny. Bunny's really cute, and I like that she's herself. I like that she's unique, and she embraces everything that's unique about her. Jessie from Jessie Smiles. I think sometimes she goes a little crazy, but I think that's like the cool thing about her is that, you know, that's really her and she, you know, just like Bunny, she doesn't shy away from herself. She She's true to herself and those are the kind of YouTubers that I like. Um, I really like Amanda News. She, who else? There, there's like someone that I'm forgetting who I absolutely love. Um, I don't know, Gator Mom, she's um, a woman who does like packing videos and things like that for GGD, um, but those are just a few of them. Um, what is your favorite movie? I have so many favorite movies, like I have, I have like a top 50. Um, I really like Hairspray, the old version, the one that John Waters produced. I like um, Jawbreaker, I like um, Jingle All the Way, I like... Anything that takes me back to my childhood, so like the craft, um, crybaby, um, honestly, like a lot of like 90s movies I just love. I love Disney movies, um, so I have a lot of favorite movies. I love uh, Harold and Kumar go to White Castle. It's just it's just the most hilarious thing to me. Um, so I have a pretty wide variety variety of um, movies that I love. I love I Love Lucy. I know that's not a movie, but I do, I, like, I love, like, old movies and things like that. So, yeah, those are a couple. What is, no, no. favorite memory from childhood? Okay, so my favorite memory from childhood is one that involves my aunt. When we were younger, we used to, like, when we played school, like, we played school. Like, we had, um... One of my other aunts, she, and we were, like, we were all kind of in the same age range. Not really, but at least like four, like four years apart from each other. Um, but anyway, one of my aunts worked out at school, and so she would bring papers from her school. So we would set up like desks outside, and you know, we, we did like the whole nine yards for, if we were playing something, we were like gonna play it, like we were gonna fucking do it, you know? Um, we played house, and we would get, we would get like blankets and we would put them outside. We had like little pillow things. Anyway, we were able to set up like the blankets to where they were walls. So we would set up houses and things like that. And there was one time, well, there, there was actually a lot of times where this would happen, but um, we would be done playing and it was time to pick up and all that stuff. So we would, <laughs> okay, so we'd be picking up the mess and everything. And I would just like, I don't know what I would, I think I would just like go off and just like leave up them or leave my aunt picking up the mess and one day I found her in the corner and she was crying and I'm like why are you crying what's going on and she's like well you know we play and then you never help me pick up <laughs> and it was true I'm like I don't know what you want me to do because you know I just don't want to do that <laughs> so that was one of my funniest moments I just thought it was so I mean sad now but I thought it was hilarious that you know she was crying in the corner and it was about me helping her pick up so I'm an asshole but um that was funny anyway that like went off um 
Do I speak any different languages? No, I do not. <laughs> um, I can understand Spanish a little bit, but not too much. Do I have any siblings? No, I do not have any siblings. I'm an only child. Um, yeah. How would you describe your fashion sense? Um, honestly, I'm a little bit all over the place because depending on my mood, I have moments where like I want to be like pearl earrings, really nice and soft fabrics and things like that, you know. And I'm not at like my goal weight. So I pretty much live in like t-shirts like this and tights or, you know, I wear toms and you know, I really I'm I'm trying to figure out my whole like mom um my mommy wardrobe. But right now I really just live in um just cool t-shirts and jeans or uh, leggings. That's my thing right now. Um, what are some of your favorite TV shows? So, um, Sex and the City, I Love Lucy. Those are like my go-to shows. If I want to watch something and I want to watch like oh, like back-to-back -back episodes, it'll be I Love Lucy or Sex and the City. I love Sex and the City. Um, PC or Mac? I don't care. <laughs> Honestly, I just don't care. Um, what phone do you have? A crappy one. Uh, tell us one of your bad habits. One of my bad habits is um, taking things out and not putting them back. So that's a horrible habit. Um, but yeah, that was the last question. I hope you guys enjoyed this tag and I hope you guys got to know me a little bit better. Um, but if you guys like this video, again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.